Hello students. So in this video, we'll be talking about the vacant seats notification released by HPNLU Shimla. Right? HPNLU Shimla on 22nd of June 2023 released a notification in which they have mentioned that in BLLB category, they have 14 unreserved vacant seats, SC category vacant seats of 2, ST category vacant seats numbered 2 and PWD vacancy of 2 seats. Whereas in BBLNB, there are 10 unreserved to PWD and Himachal Pradesh category, there is no such vacancy, right? Now, let's have a look at the fee payable in this regard. The fee payable is 2000 rupees. In short, I will talk about how you are required to pay this fee. And the last date for application is 25th June 2023. So, make sure that you, you, you fill this application form before 25 June 2023, right? Let's get into the application form and try to understand how to fill the application form, right? So once you enter the credentials, once start with the HPNLU, right? Once you click at the login credentials which are required to be filled, you will be taken to this page wherein you can put your email address and all other details after which your account will be created, right? Once your account is created, you have to follow nine steps. What are the steps, right? In first step, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to download this particular PDF, which is mentioned at the end. Download this. The title of the document is undertaking form final three. You have to download this, this form, once you download, you need to fill the details of the form in the ordered structure as asked, right? So all these details have to be filled, right? Keep, fill all these details and keep a scan copy of that or else you can do one thing. You can take a photo of that provided the clarity of the picture is up to the mark, right? So once you complete this, you can go to the second st stage. In second stage, you are required to give your personal information that is your name, your father's name, mother's name, your photograph, your signature, a copy of both signature and photograph. Make sure that you keep it ready, right? The dimension should also match the way it has been mentioned. Suppose your file is big, you can use the tools. There are many tools on Google which you can use to, you know, uh, diminish the quality and the, you know, picture resolution. So as to fit here, right? After that, once you fill all your personal details, you will be taken to second page where you have to fill the details of your parents, both mother and father, right? Once you do this, you will be taken to next page where you have, you have to complete your standard 10th related information. That is, which board did you appear in? What was your percentage? What was the application number or the mark sheet number, roll number? After that, you will be taken to the fifth step, which is taken to fifth step, which is the let me complete this. Once you do this, you will be taken to the next page which is the fifth stage of the application where you have to mention the details of your class 12th or diploma the one unit right so if you are pursuing right now you can click on pursuing and provide the inf information accordingly if you have completed then also you can provide the information according right once you have done this you can go to the next page Here you have to mention the details regarding the examination, which is CLAT, right? So once you choose the examination CLAT, here you are required to provide your roll number, application number, your All India rank and marks you secured, right? Say I fill all these details. Once you complete it, you will be taken to the seventh stage. Here, there is a preference as to what 
program do you want to choose there are two programs as you know blllb and bblb so you can keep your preferences according say i want bba over blllb right so i can keep it as one and the other one as two you can do the vice versa if you feel that blllb is your preference compared to bblb once you complete with your preference the eighth step is filling the document there are four documents that are mandatorily to be provided right the undertaking remember the undertaking that we had downloaded at the first at the beginning right you have to download that fill that scan that or take a picture of that scan would be better and you have to upload the pdf copy right similarly your 10th class mark sheet you have to update mandatorily all others are optional see what all things are required and accordingly update right your 2023 admit card and score card are mandatory so you can click on that and upload it right next to it right your 12th class mark sheet your aadhar card you can upload these documents but it's not mandated right so once you complete this you will be taken to this particular page where you can cross check all the information once you cross check you have to click on i agree button on click when you click i agree button you are confirming to the declarations which are mentioned here so open it read it once if you want right what are what are the terms and condition to which you are agreeing right now once you click on i agree button the payment mode will come right so you have to accordingly proceed and pay as i have told you the payment amount is 2000 rupees so once you pay that 2000 amount you will be successfully registered and the hpnl hpnl your administration will contact you if your rank suits best for the vacancies right that's all for today's video i wish you all the best thank you so much